na 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 Good morning, followers, viewers. Today is day six of our trip across the part of Africa, part one Karamoja road trip, and day five of the expedition. Because remember, expedition started right from the first stop of a city which was Lira. From Lira up to Kidepo it is approximately uh, six to seven hundred kilometers from there and from home yeah seven hundred kilometers from home I think uh, 300 400 kilometers from Lira here and we are still enjoying have fun immensely on our trip and today is the day six of the trip and day five of the expedition today briefing we gonna first yesterday we been enjoying as i'll share with you all we have been having fun enjoy the trip of yesterday and then we visit the only place which in the whole uganda you can find ostrich and it was so wonderful so spectacular and magnificent to have we confirmed yesterday i personally confirmed as they said the ostrich can run 80 kilometers per hour i've put this machine side of the road and the wrestle started and i confirm yes indeed ostrich can rent can 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 run that kilometers confirmed yesterday and we really enjoy that view of the visiting face to face with the ostrich in uganda and in kidepo across the part of africa ostrich visited yesterday and that's on that's not all we went and confirm and see the border point at the extremely end look at the map that's it we have been at the end of uganda shared border with southern sudan to be able to reach the boundary we stood at the boundary of uganda at north eastern uganda as promised we made it look at the place the next mountain that side is the mount volcanic Mrogore mountain it has its great story as well as per the local he said there was a kingdom on top or below the mountain but it was in the mountain a kingdom the name Otuke mountain and Otuke kingdom from there it was this is a great story I will share with you sooner than later that's fantastic it was really incredible history about that hill we really have fun and really enjoy this was really fascinating fascinating absolutely fascinating story and we visited the water stream of the place i've tested it even today this morning i've washed my face with the water from the spring water really it was so so a lot of 
excitement and we have a lot of fun. That's not all. What about the world life, the world animal? On our coming back, we visited so a spectacular view of the variety of animals. For example, zebra. In a, in, in a massive number. Buffaloes. Uh, what else was it? Water bugs. Wathogs. A lot of species of birds. Endless number. We've been able to encounter those kind of. And this morning again, a glory, glory sounds of the bird. Even up to now, you can hear. So majestic, spectacular, and wonder, wonder, wonderful. Good. Please, can you say what you saw? Yes, don't say what you don't see. <laughs> so, say what you, you saw, we saw. Yesterday Please. was a day of its own, my brothers, our fellow uh, viewers and followers. It was a very spectacular day that we saw so many uh, uh, beautiful stuff. Um, we saw a number of ostriches. Ostriches? Quite so many, like, a, like 30 or 40 in a group. Then we saw uh, a very beautiful mountain over Tuke. Then we also saw the hot spring, uh, are they called hot spring pots? Yeah. yeah. With uh, um, warm water, which an explanation is, I think, was already given on, given before, um, as to why the water is uh, warm, but it has a green, um, a green vegetation. Can you imagine? Something unbelievable. That on people, top, need, yeah. Yeah, people need to come and really see what we're talking about. We won't say so much. The best we request is please come over and discover. We are doing this for you. We are spending our time going through so many uh, risks, but we're enjoying it, and we're very we love it, and we love it. But all this is for you. You better join us. Watch for another. Um, um, we're looking forward for another expedition. Today's over Landa. <laughs> over today. <laughs> I, you finish. I, I, <laughs> they, they won't fail me. It's okay. <laughs> <What? Thank you. laughs> so we're looking forward for another day, and we shall give you a feedback on what we will have, we what we will have seen, and um, we are very optimistic that it's going to be a wonderful day as well. Sure. So please keep keep online, keep following around. us, and um, stick around with us. We will All give right. you the best. All we'll right. See you there. Hmm. Out for Cheers, now. guy. Cheers. Oh we said cheers. <laughs> now, Afandi. Yes, please. Afandi, yes. you're going to tell us the plan yeah. of the day. Today we have a new from northeast. Today it may be west. Campus out. He has, yes. the, best, he has the best campus. He has the best campus ever. He's going to be giving us the briefing of the new day. This is a new day. When I say new, I'm meaning now. We're going to start a new day. Please tell us what did you prepare. Because I know you know more about this bush and their stories. Please feel free and share with our followers, our friends, our brothers who also become weird inspired. We inspire you to do the same because we our journey is worth it because it's rewarding and what we expect we got thank you very much thank you very much viewers our viewers today we are going for another yet another uh viewing in the park you have heard i don't have to repeat to you what they have experienced is enough to portray what we are providing here as a guide here Today we are going to cover other sector of the park. We have been in the south of the park. You have heard we have gone to the north, northeast of the park as far as the Sudanese, Sudan, southern Sudan border. But now we feel we still we are still left with a portion that is the western part of the park. We shall go to the area called Nago Sokopire. Nago Sokopire, that's a very long word. But shouldn't surprise you when you come here, you will understand what it means, what is meant by that word. It's a Kalmajong word, a little bit like Latin. We, there we, our expectation there, we expect to look for more of the cards, 
bigger mammals like elephants, giraffes, and others may, may be viewed like zebra and so on. So we, today we shall do much of the western part of the park, then also south, uh, southwest of the park. And I think after the after the game viewing of the day, the result will be given back to you by the crew and the team on board. So I wish you a nice time, but remember what we are trying to do is to encourage you to come, better come, and see by yourself that never. Thank you. All right, very, very, thank you. Very, very immensely. Thank you for that brief and sounds, sounds lovely. Remember, I'm gonna wind that, I wind it up, bye. You know, such kind of, we have to make an election, by election. All, all the way since we started the beginning of the journey up to where we will end and we will make a comparison of the campsite and make an election which one is, is the, it was a, a stunning when I say stunning I mean it such stunning campsite I think to me my election has been given the vote already somewhere I'm not saying but I'm going to give you already to have a wake up call of the sound of the bird. You will tell me where was it if you've really been following our journey. So stick around, stick around for the new day as we're going to explore and inspiring you to do this. Visit. If you are one overland enthusiastic, two, if you are one life or one animal enthusiastic or if you are birds enthusiastic stick around there's still we got a lot looking forward to you and my name is Norris my also filmmaker is here stick around now are you still with us Just wake up this morning and this is what we can see which can which the, the reward of this early morning is this these two lions seated on top of the of the rock the rock name is Calabe rock it's so lovely fantastic spectacular view we are seeing right now it's something else and this is what set up uh, uh, Kidepo Valley National Park apart from other parks because just be next hundred meters with two lines on top of the rock that is so lovely gorgeous fantastic spectacular all sort of a good name a good qualification of such kind of beautiful magnificent magnificent and really we have got exactly what we have been looking for so it shows our trip never been waste of time it's really rewarding it and it's worth it have two lion king of the jungle on top of the rock and get a shot from there it's something else that's really spectacular spectacular we pass here for three times we never get a chance we we we, we, we turn the rock for more than enough 
but we never get a chance but this tomorrow it's always it's always wherever you find such kind of shot it shows it's a blessing day and we're gonna have a lot of when i love to what i love to call fishing day or i love to call it have hey, finish it um glorious day fantastic magnificent a glory there's plenty of glory shot we are getting here it's something else because this kind of shot i always see sometime on discovery channel one but today we are live when you are watching it you also call it you're watching it live from nn intercontinental adventure and this project was called named aleron across the pearl of africa that's what made the country uganda to be called the pearl of africa two lion on top of the hill of the of the of the rock it's something magnificent and spectacular look at it mm. today we've been having a lovely day and what a day Woo. All right, continue. Let's continue now. I think we got it. Let's continue. All right. See the lion on top of the rock. It's really magnificent. He's cleaning his uh, legs, his hands, his hands, I think. Yeah. This is really, really an old, old lion. Yeah, and we're here, we are not alone. Even other friends as well, they're also enjoying the same view with us. What a day. He's also trying to enjoy the view of this the landscape and the fresh air from the top that is the lion the lion the king on his on top of his palace top of his palace it's really spectacular fantastic and he's here top of it. It's good. It's there. I am Nur Ismail Nozur, diesel engineer. Join me as I share my passion for building four-wheel drive trucks and traveling to the remotest part of the world. Okay.